Bandung income disparities is getting wider and wider. Uh, meaning that uh, more and more uh, rich people are here and also at the same time there are a lot of people uh, so poor that have difficulties to access the food. One of the important actors in the food system is the street vendors. The street uh, vendors is, uh, is the, uh, the most, uh, the cheapest uh, affordable food for the poorest. Uh, then probably you think, oh, why don't they just cook themselves? Uh, okay, uh, the first thing, not all of their uh, place to stay is uh, make that possible. There's no cooking facilities. The space is so small. So, or that, uh, so the only way they can access food is uh, to gain access to the food that already made outside. The food are available, but the the problem is accessibility uh, because they are poor. They are, uh, they can only afford uh, the cheapest uh, food available. So it's not. Uh, uh, accessibility, uh, physical accessibility, but uh, economical accessibility, that's a problem. So Indonesia now, in terms of food security, is still in the narrative of production. Thinking of uh, uh, to gain uh, food security status for uh, national or for regional is uh, by producing so much enough for the population. I think uh, the issue now is it's more than that. It's not that simple. Even though we have enough production, we have enough supply, then if it's not accessible to the poor, then it's not there for them. The ideal Bandung will be the Bandung that uh, have uh, or create good quality, uh, accessible food for everybody.